It's full moon 2.0, kids. Red robe astrology for June 22nd. You know, that lunation yesterday happened at one degree of Capricorn. That means the moon has all of the rest of the degrees of Capricorn to move through. So I call this today very much full moon in Capricorn as much as yesterday was. But also there's a rumble of unconscious release today that was part of yesterday's lunation. And that's exact today, the sun hitting Pluto in the great eliminator angle. So in the full moon, anytime Pluto's involved, then we have an extra sort of unconscious rumble because Pluto is the arbiter of everything that is disowned and hidden and in our own personal underworld, right? So with the sun and Pluto in the inconjunct, we've got like the basement doors ajar. It's like, and the music starts and you hear in the horror movie, don't go down into the basement, but we must. And even if you're not in some deep narrative like that today, our uh, unconscious might be rumbling that might show up as some free floating stuff. <laughs> Feel in a certain kind of way. Meanwhile, Mercury is squaring the nodes of the moon. That's a collective point that means we're active and about out and about connecting with others. But because it's 90 degree squares, out of obligation, the activity that we have to engage in today could be stressful rather than coming from ease and flow. Um, Capricorn moon does keep us somewhat grounded and stable. Um, but there's this interesting cardinal grand square in, uh, being triggered by the moon. It's going to oppose Mercury, and uh, both of them are squaring the nodes. The moon is squaring the nodes, Mercury is squaring the nodes from the other side of the cosmos. So <clears throat> cardinal squares create change or initiate new sort of directions and new cycles, right? So we're in a full moon. There might be blah, 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 blah. <laughs> there might be important conversations today or important words today if you can get through there being maybe too many, <laughs> as you just saw play out. Um, back to the sensation of the day. Uh, um, the moon will try in Mars. It's the only real positive lunar aspect. So we've got good, some energy, focus. Capricorn moons loves energy and focus. It's physical. An opposition from the moon to Venus means your heart might be triggered. Uranus puts a little spice of sudden shifts in the in the mix. <clears throat> and there's this other great eliminator angle between the moon and Jupiter that says the grass might be greener on the other side. Go to the other side today. You might enjoy some green grass. Have at it.